My fraud of the week is not sports related, it, but it uh, it has to do with over the weekend. A lot of schools had graduation, so they had you know their virtual commencement speeches. And Fremont High School, that is where from Senator Ben Sass is from. And so he was the commencement speech. And this was the and, and commencement let's be honest commencement speeches on, as a whole are stupid and they suck anyway but his was phenomenally bad like it was a whole nother level of bad so his commencement speech it's all over the place he references his dad wanting to be a gym teacher because he didn't want to wear formal clothes he wanted to wear shorts and t-shirt then made some joke about a rope, and he's like, yeah, gym teachers are important because, you know, every so often, a couple times a week, somebody's going to tell you to climb a rope. Now, it'll probably be a metaphorical rope, but it's a rope. I've never had to climb a rope in gym no, class. I didn't. Because we're not as fit anymore. Yeah, he calls this generation fat and lazy. Do you think that's what he it is? Says, he says is high school why? and commencement speeches don't matter, and it's... But I'm proud of you regardless. You won't know about this or you won't care about this. You're the only generation that will remember your high school because of COVID-19. Proceeds to talk about the pandemic in a political way, saying, thanks, China, those Chinese thugs at one point. He says, uh, "Don't uh, there's, uh, you're going to need psychological help. So sit, making fun of kids now with mental health, saying that, well, you know, there's no money. Don't get a psychology degree. There's no money in that or Trashing psychologists. This is a trigger fest. <laughs> Trash is, like, it's just, like, I'm all for, I don't, like, it's just terrible. And I, I understand making jokes and making light of things. And then his spokesperson comes out and says people need to take a joke. No, you need to do your job. You need to be competent. And I'm not even talking about politics. I mean talking for 10 minutes without disparaging people. So is this a, I'm, I'm not familiar with the... Cornhusker delegation to Washington. Is this a, a U.S. He's a U.S. Senator, senator or a not a state senator? He's okay. a U.S. Okay, because then they had a state senator on after him. Mm -hmm. But normally I wouldn't care about this, but this is ridiculous. Just go up there, do some cheesy, lame quotes about the future or whatever. Say good job and be on with your day. Don't bring up China. Don't bring up any politics at all, really. And oh, I forgot. If you're named Jeremy, Ben Sass hates you because he said anybody named Jeremy is a bad person. I kid you, that's not a direct quote. I'm paraphrasing, but he did say that. So my guess is he his some some girl he was dating in high school got plowed by some guy that was a psychologist and happened to be named Jeremy. Ron Jeremy. <laughs> maybe. Maybe Ron she Jeremy. was on a video. I don't know. <laughs> ben Sass, you were a disgrace to the state of Nebraska. You're a disgrace to You know what? Yeah, you're a disgrace to Nebraska. Ouch. What, you are the worst thing to happen in Nebraska since Bill Callahan.